Uganda's Chief of Defense Forces General David Muhozi is in Somalia for a routine visit and to check on the progress registered by Ugandan forces that are currently deployed in Sector 1. Meeting with Ambassador Francisco Madeira, the head of AMISOM, General Muhozi commended troops from all troop contributing countries to AMISOM for their efforts in degradation of Al Shabaab extremists. I can only say that the resilience of the enemy is matched by the resilience of the troops in AMISOM, or of all the TCCs. Uganda happens to be one of them, and we are proud uh, to contribute to the peace and security of Somalia. On his part, Ambassador Francisco Madeira observed that the visit by General Mohose offers reassurance to the mission leadership and troops. To create space for the government to occupy and be present in much wider areas than it is. Make sure that the checkpoints and the tax collection points by Al Shabaab are dismantled and that Lego, sooner than later, is back into the hands of the government. Al Shabaab took over control of Lego in Lower Shebere region in August 2017 after Amisom troops withdrew from a forward operating base situated in the area. The town lies about 120 kilometers southwest of Mogadishu and is of strategic importance to Somalia because it links Mogadishu to western regions of Bay and Bakol. General Mohozi also held discussions with the Amisom Deputy Force Commander in charge of operations and plans, Major General Charles Tai Gutai, and Amisom staff officers at the force headquarters. There are others that we should be able to focus on specific priority areas, and these priority areas are the ones that we are working on. So for the CDF to visit, we are briefed on all those issues to what is uh, able to understand. General Mohozi's visit to Somalia comes at a time when Ugandan troops under Battle Group 23 are completing their one year tour of duty and are preparing to hand over to Yuga Bag 24. Samuel Senono, UBC News.